Hi, um, I'm Believer here, um, also known as Dan. Um, trying to get through this really quickly so I can go watch Supernatural in like a half hour. So, uh, yeah, I have 13 questions. Let's do this. Um, first question from Dean and Dean, um, from Beth. Do you think I'm Satan? Considering the thread we have with Dean and Dan, um, with him calling her a traitor because of choosing Sam to date over him because she panicked at the time. Yeah, yeah, I see you, Satan, right now. Anyway, next, every other question is from Elena is Human. Um, how did you get into role playing? How long have you been role playing for? And did you start on Tumblr? I started in 2011 on Facebook with pages because a friend of mine from high school um, around the start of my senior year was talking to this Elspeth page, Queen Elspeth. Still not sure what movie she's from. Um, she was talking to her about Christians at her school and whatnot, and I got really confused because I was one at the time, and we just got to talking and she explained what role playing was, and then telling me about other character cases you could find around Facebook, so I went and looked for them. Long story short, short, I got really into it, and then I got comment blocked after talking to pages for a long time. And then December of 2011, I made my first OC, um, Janet Song, which I'm totally not original with my name at the time. But, uh, yeah, that was my first Time Lady, though she did not become a Time Lady until several months afterwards. She was just a person in an orphanage that did not know who she was, or where she was from, or if she even had family left. Or anywhere, for that matter. But, uh, yeah. That's, that's a thing. Um, how has your roleplay experience been? Hopefully a good one. It's been alright. I got hate a couple of times on my first blog that is now archived. But it was only for things like, you need to trim your posts. And at the time, I was just starting out. I didn't know how to trim posts, so. And then, the other time was... Um, someone, like, making, like, getting all uppity because I decided to kind of, like, they were just getting upset because Jan is kind of a self-insert sort of character. They're like, you don't want that, you can just, like, go do duck or something. I say duck, not game. Duck. Um, let's see what else is here. Um, name some people or things that inspire you and why. Um, there's Nathaniel Bugolich, however you pronounce that. The guys from Supernatural, Jensen, Jared, and Misha. Thomas Sanders, and Demi Lovato. Just because... I can't even explain why, they just are. Just because Thomas Sanders videos and vines and whatnot, they're just, they help me forget a lot of stuff I have going on. Uh, same with Demi Lovato, like, she has been through so much, but she's been staying strong. And I have her book, actually, of 365 quotes a year. It's hiding somewhere under my bed. That helped me a lot last year. Um, you know, I kind of quit reading the book after a while because I couldn't find it. But, uh, yeah, them and the SP Supernatural actors, they talk about dealing with stuff and whatnot. And just the videos I find of them at, at conventions on YouTube and whatnot, it's really helpful. Uh, Nathaniel, again, he has been a big inspiration because of him 
sewing his face and doing a whole bunch of stuff for charities and whatnot and just keeping up just a good attitude about everything and just like I read his stuff on Twitter and whatnot. Just he's really awesome. Um top shows and movies and whatnot. Um Supernatural, The Tomorrow People, Graceland, Once Upon a Time, Night at the Museum, Star Trek, The Avengers, yeah, those, those are things. Uh, five random facts about myself. I got this puppy from Build-A-Bear for my birthday, because in my opinion, you are not too old for Build-A-Bear, and... Just, yeah. Um, I can say I am super shy until you really get to know me, then you better watch out. I'm super protective of my friends, and I really love the new bottle. Uh, my hobbies, it's Netflix, role playing, and sleeping. That there's not much to it. Some chips I have with my character, Songchester, that's Dean Winchester and Jan. Uh, Moose Tunes, that's Sam Winchester and Jan. Young Mischief, that's Loki from the Avengers and Jan. Shifter's Song, that's Elliot, uh, my friends OC, and Jan. Um, I can't really talk about them a lot because I'm short on time. Um, some plots you really love or miss. Uh, this is one called Broadway Baby. It's basically one. The first news has been working really, really, really hard towards being an actor on Broadway, or actress, you know. And, like, 20 minutes before curtains go up and the debut is going to happen, um, everybody's freaking out and the crew is saying she's supposed to go on, and so the other news has to go and find the first news and finds them freaking out and they've got to help them get through their moment of freaking out and help them through their stage fight and whatever and they after the show is over they realize that the first news needs them a lot to help them through stuff and just yeah I really 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 want that plot because I never really got to play it out, and it's just, it's, it fixed my news so much. Um, a childhood memory, a news earliest memory, fifth birthday party, um, she climbed into this big truck with a few of her cousins and her dad and her brother, and they just started driving down this road in a small town in Arizona, like, it was, it was at the time, it was literally so small. Uh, most of businesses and houses, phone numbers, all around you to fit on one side of a page in the phone book. And basically they just drove for a while until they came to this campground park area and they had her fifth birthday, fifth birthday party. And she got this like block set and a tea party set from her grandma and aunts and whatnot. It was just, it was a party. Uh, why did you put your face thing? In a nutshell, because I can. But like, more on to that, Mia was basically the one of several I considered. I mean, I considered her and Vanessa Hudgens. Uh, her face plan before this one I had was Zoe de Chanel, because at the time, glasses and whatnot, but then I realized her her eyes were blue, and my character does not have blue eyes, so I kind of went through a lot of decision making, and I just really liked Nina, so yeah, I just kind of went with her. And if people don't like my choice of face plane, again, they can go eat a duck or something. 
just don't complain to me about it. Like, if you don't like it, there's the door. Ah, uh, yeah, so I have a little bit more time left. But, so, shout outs, I guess. Um, like, okay, I gotta do this and not be stuttering. Because, yeah. Um, first one, uh, One Man Disneyland. Let's see, Antidote Vlog, I mentioned earlier. Sky, you're awesome. I love you. That part is seriously messed up. I don't know why I bother trying to do that. But I love you. I love Broadway babies. You're awesome. It's, yeah. Um, spell creator slash annex slash telekinetic slash spell liaison slash whatever else other logs you have. Uh, Linz, you're really, really awesome. I can't even explain how much I look up to you. Like, through all the stuff you go through that I watch on my dash. Like, I know... You're really, really awesome, and I wish there could be more that I could say to help you through a lot of the crap that goes on, but I, as you can see, I suck with words, but I really do love you, you're awesome, you're like a big sister to me, so, yeah. Yeah. That, that, that is as best or hard as it's gonna get. <laughs> but, it's really messed up, but, you know. Um, Tomorrow Techie. Rookie, love you too. You are amazing. And just your internet hugs after just everything that I have to go through here and just your support through my mental breakdowns is really, really appreciated. I love you and all your characters so much. Just, if I could hug you from over here, I would, but just, you know, yeah. Um, Dr. Mark, Mr. Dark, and Nick Monroe, The Devil's Vessel. I've known you guys for years now, along with a bunch of others that I will not mention right now because I'm short on time. But you guys are amazing. I love you guys. Um, your characters are simply amazing. I love you, you and your vlogs. Um, I am totally repeating myself right now. But, um, you guys, you guys know how I feel. And, like, just, yeah. Oh, Polly. I will probably be getting my license soon, so I will eventually probably be able to come up there and see you. So that's the thing. Um, who else is there? Um, Oxen Ra and Kamun Ra and just whatever else there is. I can't remember the other URLs. But like, you guys are really, really awesome for playing the, those bummy peoples and whatnot from the museum. Like, I admire you guys so much, and I hope we can do more stuff. Uh, soon, maybe. And, you just, you guys are, I can't words right now because there is a recording timer going, and I am running out of time here, so, yeah, just all of you guys, I love you a lot, and just keep being awesome. Okay, bye.